the, uh, the thing about radio, may, maybe we shouldn't mention ra- radio as 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 the word. Uh, I did have a conversation near near the Cedar uh, st- studio, which I'm going to call a temp radio studio. It's there till Saturday, and um, I explained I'd been trying to get. Well, I, I'd see, I tried, started out describing it as art. The temp radio studio hashtag. Uh, not this year. Last year, it seemed to make sense to me. Um, there was proposals for something that would use a, an empty shop for a while or connect with walking, uh, moving about in the city. And I thought, because the studios were locked down, or the, the, the um, phonic studio, we weren't allowed into it, but different people were recording things at home and uh, sending them in and that sort of worked some of the time um, and I think there were a lot of places that were the same as that and um, it, it, it was a good thing in that in the, it pushed what technology was available so I, I think sound um, transfer recording all seemed to be possible from home and um, now that people are allowed back in proper studios I think it's time to work out what the um, what the mix can be if you've got uh, a budget for the studio you can connect it to whatever exists at home or whatever exists in the street or wherever it happens to be and if if the uh, radio isn't live or st- streamed immediately in terms of what is happening online I, I don't think it matters um, a, a lot, if it's a if it's a live sporting occasion, obviously it does matter. But a lot of the time, it doesn't matter that much. So, um, if I mean things could be recorded in Princess Hay this week, and they could be broadcast this evening or tomorrow, and that wouldn't be the end of the world, I don't think. As it happens, they've got the, I think they're broadcasting live, online, um, from. Just towards the end of of the, the Debenhams building, going towards Southern Hay, so you can go there and put in a request or demand a conversation or whatever um, but that's one one of the things that was suggested to me if you if you want to present radio as art is not to use the word radio use the word use the word um, soundscape or um, don't use the word interview community engagement uh, so it's some, it's some sort of conversation um, anyway I think I think the the it could be the moment for the ideas I was trying to think of as as art has gone because um, uh, we're not supposed to be political but it's it's because of the elections and everything but it, it's not just the government there's lots of people who are just going back to normal so that whole f- phase when um, working at home looking at online technology intensively it's all sort of gone it's, has it gone completely pre- it's gone gone quite a lot um, there's lots of people moving in different directions so uh, in terms of the hashtag um, temp radio studio it's still there and I'll still use it but uh, I think I'm just going to uh, relate to what Cedar are doing access all areas and um, try and document that the rest of the week so probably on the, the drama show tomorrow between 8 and 10 I'll, I'll say some more about the theory of it and then in um, the wild show, when there's three of us, we'll probably be able to move move about a bit, and um, we'll probably go go over there and phone back again. Very advanced technology, which only only Phonic has in this situation, I think, is the mobile phone to the studio big box, which are, one one of us can work out how to how to use it. We will have, we will have a producer tomorrow. Uh, I think I've not, now I've got in a muddle as to which CD is which. This is the We Don't Know show. I'm going to I'm going to try this one. <laughs> 